All right, welcome once again. Uh, this is James. Uh, I wanted to do an update on showering in my van. I came up with yet a third system. Uh, this time, I really think I got it. Uh, so I'm going to go over with you right now. Hold on. So the first one I had was actually a power a pump, DC powered pump that I plugged into a, my car lighter and then it pumps water from any type of water container um, and then uh, you know it uses like just like a shower but the problem with that is is that it uh, used up water way too quickly um, I would heat up water in my hot water kettle and put the pump in there and turn it on and by the time I was even ready to use it all the water was done um, so I really got an understanding of how much water we use. The second thing I went to was just a simple uh, spray, um, not fancy at all, not um, as hydrating as the shower pump was, but uh, it got the job done after a lot of pumps. I mean, pump, 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 pump. And I put it on spray, of course, not on um, stream. So I got the most effective water. Um, and that way, this way, I could um, heat up water, and then it would be hot water that I would be spraying on myself. I would first, of course, uh, spray myself with water, uh, get into this bath. As you can see, I've just taken a bath. I'm sorry for the dirty water. And then I would scrub myself with soap, and then I would spray myself down. And then another key thing is a chamois towel because um, it dries so fast and then on my chair here I don't know how well you can see I have a towel so once I'm in the bathtub and I'm done spraying and lubing up and scrubbing myself I then dry myself off using the towel and then I sit here and get my feet and my legs and anything else um, and this way the towel uh, doesn't get too wet and really the chamois uh, takes up most of the water and it dries up the quickest. Anyway, the newest addition is this uh, pesticide sprayer here. It's battery powered. Um, fear not, I emptied out all the pesticides and I rinsed it several, several times. Anyway, this thing is the most effective. It carries the most amount of water all in one unit and then you have this battery powered sprayer here um, that works you have like three settings a stream a spray and then a bigger sprayer and as you can see uh, let me take the lock off it um it's just starting up now once it gets the water in there oh wait a second i forgot to pop this up. Another thing is the tube runs all the way down so I can get all this water um, that's in the whole thing and I heat up hot water even hotter than I did when I put it into the spray bottle. I get it steaming hot because this cannot carry all the water that's in this. So I fill up as much as I can with this, add it to this which is either cold or lukewarm water and so this is steaming water with that it makes warm water and uh, I just have a whole bunch of water I can just rinse and spray and shower as long as I want anyway now for a demonstration but as you can there it is as you can see I mean it's a pretty good I, I, I find this is the best solution ever uh, and then everything just tucks away in a nice little convenient little to-go thing. I'll pop that down, boom, ready to go. I can even wind this up, put it all away, uh, do whatever I want. Um, of course, I got my toiletries here. And uh, so that's my little shower in a container. If it was black, um, that would be even better because then I could just heat it up uh, solar. Um and uh, not even have to use any gas. Anyway, I just wanted to give you a uh, look on my newest uh, showering method, and I hope this helps you out. Not all the time you can get to a truck stop or a gym or even outside, so that's why I like to shower. 
inside um, uh, because I'm an urban dweller. So um, talk to you guys later. Bye.